Count yourself blessed. If you are still here and you have your family members still here, nobody passed away, thank you, Jesus. I'm not going to knock on wood, but I'm just going to give God his praise and honor that he deserves for keeping us. What's up, my love bugs and love muffins? It's Mama Love, and welcome back to my channel. And I am here today because I am going to be doing a cooking video, a requested cooking video that you all have been asking me to do for a while. I have not been doing any cooking videos because we were meal prepped since January. So yes, we are no longer going to be meal prepped, having any of the meal prepped foods. I am going to be doing this myself. Um, I've had enough meal prep foods to know how they prep it. I've also kept the dishes. So I kept everything as far as all the meal preps. These are not all the bowls. Of course, it will be no place to put them. But I kept bowls, little uh, square bowls, the meal prep, uh, meal, main meal prep trays, and all the tops that go along with them. So this is going to be fun. So I decided to make my own meal preps and I can do this. But today I am going to be doing a, um, was it shrimp stir fry? Shrimp vegetable stir fry with rice and I'm kinda adding my own sauce. I'm mixing the shrimp with another type of shrimp with which is shrimp scampi. So in this bowl is the plain shrimp. That's gotta be cooked up. And I'm gonna put seasonings on it. Slap your mama for one. Salt garlic pepper i mean gar garlic salt and black pepper and sunny turned me on to this this how's it pronounced sunny Sasson. Sasson goya um it is a good seasoning for all types of meats um that one is for chicken vegetables yeah, chicken and vegetables good that's cool and so then i have here the shrimp scampi y'all it's not fried it's actually um like Tighten up, saute, and this is the sauce that is in, which I'm gonna be adding my sauce with this. And only sauce that I'm really adding is really country. Uh, I'm just gonna add some country crock butter. And a little lemon juice and some seasonings to this. And I'm gonna add it to this. And it's going to be with some vegetables. I'm gonna use um, a little bit of bag of broccoli that I have. And I'm gonna use some mixed vegetables that I have up in here. Um, like I said, we've been meal prepped since January, so this is going to be exciting to do. Yes, and I'm going to use that white rice, so. Y'all stay tuned for this video as I am prepping along the way. So I'm going to be seasoning the shrimp, like I said, with a little bit of slap your mama. some of this sazon. Ooh, sazon. Sazon, sazon, sazon. And we're gonna add some black pepper to it. And we're gonna add a little, little garlic salt to it. And we're just gonna mix it around. Okay, and I'm going to add it to a, I want to cook these first, but since, since these are both the same, I'm not going to season this bag, okay? But this, this shrimp is what I'm trying to say, this, this is the same raw that this is, so I'm going to go ahead and pour this over into this bowl as well. And I'm going to add some things. I'm make sure I want to get all this sauce, y'all, because this what you see right here is sauce, and we want that sauce. We want all that sauce because the shrimp scampi sauce, y'all. I'm sorry, it's, it's it's good. So I'm gonna add a little avocado oil to the skillet, just a little, you know, just to wanna, you know, give it a little. And I'm adding the shrimp. And this we're gonna let the shrimp, we're gonna let it cook. And I have my rice over here boil, I mean my um, water for my rice to be boiling. And after the shrimp is cooked, I will let you all see 
how it turned out. I'm gonna be adding my vegetables to this. So it's gonna be shrimp and vegetables or whatever. I kinda of want it saucy so that um, it could like go over the rice. That's the reason for me wanting to add that butter. So I may just add like a tablespoon of butter in there. And I'm also gonna add just a little uh, bit of lemon just to give it like a, a little twist or whatever. A little so, zest. Yeah, a little zest to it. So yeah, we make sure we had enough shrimp Actually, uh, other shrimp, um, they were in my, um, they were, like I said, they've been in my freezer for the longer because I had not been doing anything as far as cooking anything at home. And I hope y'all remember the aprons. I do have some new aprons coming out, by the way. Totally different saying on them. It's a meme of me. <laughs> and I got to say, um, it was on um, Martin Lewis channel. He made, a, he made a meme of me, you know. Have a blessed day. And I, yeah, I'm that lady. Bye-bye. Bye -bye. See you later. All of that. So, yes. I plan on having them put on aprons. So, um, yeah. I'm going to have that. I got that picture of that face that I be making. Like, you know. And so, I'm going to have have a blessed day on there. I'm thinking about doing some t-shirts like that. Not only just um, aprons. But, like, give me some type of uh, ideals, too, uh, below in the comments. Because you all have very good ideals for me. And, yeah. So, Stay tuned on this. Okay, so as you can see is the shrimp. Look at our shrimp here. See, just slightly sauteed. It didn't really take long at all. Cook the shrimp, but you all know that. You see the sauce in it? It's like a scampi sauce. And I want that to uh, go over, uh, fall over the rice. So right now I'm adding my vegetable, which is broccoli. Adding some broccoli in here, frozen, which I like. Gonna kind of water it down so I can add some more stuff to this, which, which I want it to do. Oh no, excuse me. And um, I'm adding um, my Asian medley, which has the other type of vegetables in it, which has some broccoli in it. Wow, I didn't know that. And I'm gonna leave that alone. I was gonna add another bag, but I think that's a bit too much. And what I'm gonna do is, um, I'm gonna go ahead and I'm just gonna add some butter. on front. I want some more butter. Okay. And I may season that and I'm going to pour over in it a little lemon juice. I want a tangy flavor to it. I don't want it to be saucy going over the um, rice. And so as that cooks, I want that to thicken, the butter to thicken along with the scampi sauce that's in it. Because basically we are almost like making more you know what I'm saying? And then I got the sassoon in it because I think that gives it a pretty color and also a nice seasoning to it. So I didn't want to overwhelm everybody with a bunch of vegetables because I'm about the only one in this house. Well, Tina eat vegetables. Terrell really don't tolerate them. Um, Sunny's been here with us for two weeks. She loves vegetables. So I kind of didn't want to really overwhelm with the vegetables. So I am going to be... Um, Oh, this one got a little cauliflower in it. Hold on, y'all. This, this a little bit more. This a little bit more. I, I'm sorry, y'all. I could, I could eat vegetables all day, but just a little, little, just a little, just, just a little. There we go. Um, uh, I think some of these vegetables got the baby corn in it and the chestnuts. They call them chestnuts. I think, yeah. And um, so that vegetable and shrimp, I want that to be like a full sauce or whatever, because I want it, like I said, to pour over that rice for me and give it so you know it don't be like a dry rice but it'd be like a saucy shrimp vegetable stir fry it won't be dry it'd be seasoned just well and y'all are going to love it so yeah okay so this is it this is the rice right here i want you all to know that i have added butter to this rice garlic salt and pepper because i want the rice to be seasoned i just don't want dry rice, I mean uh, plain white rice, your choice is your choice. These are the meal prep trays. Oh, I'm sorry. Yeah, go back to that. That's how it looks. That's our, that's our shrimp scampi with the vegetables in it. That's going to go over that rice. But these are different meal prep trays. Okay. So I'm going to be making a meal. Put them in the meal prep tray. Uh, um, I know that you know, this is being you know, meal prepped. Uh, so when I make my meal preps up, uh, it's the serving size I've learned. It's the serving size that counts. So this is what I'm putting in here. And this is what I'm going to 
use to scoop out the vegetables and the sauce and I wanted it poured over the top like that and I'm gonna give Sunny the honors of tasting this because she gonna keep it real. Um, Sunny is, is gonna try this for the first time. Like I said, she like to keep it real and so you're gonna see what she say. Now y'all don't come down on me about these meal preps about then she put you put too much butter. I, I, I said I was just cooking like this today until I go get healthier food till I go shop. So Oh well, let me put a little yeah, you know, I'm about to get a little hair thing. Can I do a bee loves? <laughs> <laughs> oh, thank you. Okay, I'm out. <laughs> <laughs> this is real good. Y'all go ahead. Y'all have a good day. You <laughs> made me up some too, y'all. Look. So you can make your meals. You can make your own meals and put them in meal prep trays. It's all about the portion size, right? Yes, everything is good in moderation. In moderation. So this is what we're gonna do now, and I'm gonna make this up. Probably the kids like this. He loves the seasoning on this. She loves the seasoning on this. So I'll probably put it with some brown rice, and they won't be able to tell, right? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah. Is it brown already? Yeah, so brown, right? brown rice. Well, you know, because it says, you know. And then we could put a little, you know, we could put the season on it. We could still have that. Also, I want to show you, stay right there. I also wanted to show you guys, um, the blackened salmon that they have at Sam's Club also. These are wonderful, you all, in the air fryer. This is how they look. You can put them in the air fryer or you can just saute them in a skillet like you, like I did. You could make you up some, some broccoli and you could put, um, you know, some cheese if you wanted to. And um, you, you, they say red skin potatoes is not that fattening, so we may do like little red skin potatoes That's with this good. dish. You know, and mash them up like mashed red skin potatoes or whatever. And, you know, there's different meals that I'm going to be making since I got the idea of the meal preps. Mm -hmm. And so, I just feel like this. Um, when the meal preps are made up, if they're not tasty, if, if the kids is not going to eat them, it's kind of like a domino effect. It wastes money. So, uh, I don't want to waste my daughter's money. I'm very grateful what she does. And so we're still going to keep the training as far as the gym, but as far as the meal preps, I just think at this time it's wasting her money and I don't want to do that. Um, I figure I can cut down the price and do my own meal preps now that I got the kind of idea of it and I got all the dishes and everything. So, This, I, this is good. Yeah. Like, this is really good. Thank you. Mm -hmm. So I, I hope that you all enjoyed this video, finally a cooking video. And like I said, look out for the aprons. Um, that's coming soon, not this brand, no, another brand and some merch coming out. So yeah, I've got a lot of help from Sunny. Sunny is helping me and taking me along the way and showing me the ropes of stream, stream yards. Stream yards. Stream yards and I wanna interact with you all more. So, and um, yeah, so yeah, so, that's it. I hope you enjoyed this video and peace out in Jesus name. Be blessed. Bye, see you later. Bye.